hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is Tosin. you welcome to another tutorial today guys i'll be teaching us how to remove zip board from our dresses the back of our dresses our tops how to remove zip board from them i got a message from someone saying our top comes out boggy at the back after fixing the zip so i want to just put us through how we can remove zip board perfectly and this step works very very perfectly trust me before going to the tutorial proper, please kindly subscribe to my channel if you haven't. Please kindly subscribe to my channel, guys. Please just click the subscribe button and don't forget to like this video if you really like it. And comment below if you have any comment for me or you want to ask me any questions. Just leave them below in the comment section and I'll be sure to reply all my comments. Thank you. So let me just quickly tell us what to do. So I've gone ahead to draft. This is the back pattern of my blouse this is a basic bodies and this is the back block but i've not you know connected the lines the first thing i'll say is if you have a waist of below 30 inches like from 29 below you remove zip budge of 0 0.5 inches from your waist but if you have waist from 30 inches above you go ahead and remove 0 0.75 inches zip budge so this is what i'm saying for me my waist is 30 inches so i'll be removing a zip budge of 0 0.75 inches now this is my zip line this is one and a half inches zip line so on that on the beginning of my zip line i'll go ahead and remove 0 0.75 i hope you can see this i'll remove 0 0.75 inches this is it I will remove 0 0.75 inches and I'll connect. I'll just connect the way it is, like this. I'll connect slantly upward as high as you can, but it doesn't necessarily need to get to the neckline. Just connect it as high as you can. I hope you can see the way I placed my ruler. And then from that same spot, I'll connect and I'll stop before I get to my blouse length, just this way. I hope you, you understand what I did. I just got my 0 0.75 inches from the beginning of the line. So I went in by 0 0.75 inches into the zip allowance I've made. And I connected from there. I connected up slantly. I didn't allow this to get to my neckline. You can just see what I did here. And from that same spot, I connected and I stopped before the hip line. So this is how you remove zip board from your... So after you've gone ahead to remove this zip board, don't forget to return whatever you removed from here back to your measurement so it doesn't shorten it off. So I'll replace, I'll replace the 0 0.75 inches I took back here. I hope you understand what I'm doing. And I'll connect. I'll connect from my armpit to the point and then to the length of my blouse so let me cut this out to show us so you can see how i'm cutting out this point they are going out let me shade it so this point is going out that is the zip board that we are removing so we are cutting this out so let me just cut it and show us how it looks like So guys, this is how you remove zip board from the back of the dress. You can see this shape is looking like the shape of the back. You know, the back has an arc kind of shape. So this is how you perfectly remove zip board from either your tops, your dresses. I hope this video is useful to you. If it is, then kindly give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel, please, guys. Kindly subscribe to my channel. It will really, really go a long way. And if you have comments, leave them for me in the comment section, and I'll be sure to reply them. Thank you for watching today's video, and I'll see you in my next one. Bye, guys.